WA farmers and volunteers are doing their bit for families on the land, hit hard by the record drought on the east coast. Today, more than a dozen trucks set off with thousands of tonnes of hay to help keep their stock alive. They gathered at dawn on a mission from the west to help struggling farmers in the east. A convoy of 16 trucks with 2,000 bales of hay, a lifeline for rural families hit with the worst drought in a generation. It's all in the act of giving. Um, so I guess when people are worse off than yourself, um, that's, I suppose it's our spirit is to give when we've got something to give. These truck drivers began their five-day journey from northern this morning. They'll cover nearly three and a half thousand kilometres to get to Condoblin in the heart of the drought on the east coast. The rescue mission, with enough hay to feed 20,000 sheep for 20 weeks, put together in just one week by the Australian Rapid Relief Team. Oh, it's what you need to do, you've all got to band together. While WA is having record rains, New South Wales and South Australia haven't seen a July drought like this since records began. The orange on this map shows drought, the red, intense drought. The Bureau of Meteorology only predicting the weather to get warmer and drier with the end of winter nearing. While well, WA farmers are having a good year this year, they've gathered down here to show their support. They say you never forget your scars from losing your crops or your stock. And even here in WA, that pain still runs deep. I've got no money, we're only on the pension because we had to walk off the farm uh, because of the drought. So I can't hand them money, but I can hand them love. That's all I can do. Kelly Haywood, Nine News. And if you'd like to help Australia's struggling farms, you can donate to the Drought Relief Appeal at todayshow.com.au.